everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your angel card reading for the week starting the 31st of January. This is the reading for Capricorn and I'm using my teacup tarot deck. So let's get right on with your reading for a really positive week. What a lovely selection of cards for you and your Overall energy here is the card, the King of Pencils. Now, the energy that comes along with the King cards in the deck is very much one of an authority figure. The King of Pencils brings along the qualities of someone who is very balanced emotionally. Someone you can turn to for advice someone who you can turn to to give you the motivation and information that you need to make your next steps. The King of Pencils is extremely well educated in complex matters, such as legal matters or paperwork that we wouldn't come across generally in everyday life. The King of Pencils is a very gifted public speaker. So here we have an ideal mentor energy coming in. So this could be you bringing these qualities to help somebody else, or it could be somebody with these qualities right here to help you. Our help or our hurdle, we have card number five, unity. Now this is all about working well together for the benefit of everybody. And if we look at the angels here, they've each brought something to the table. They're having a conversation, they're having a meeting. And when they each bring their expertise to the table, they can share that information for the benefit of all. So this is very much a card of working with others. It's the card of teachers, it's the card of mentors. So that's really interesting information for you to be mindful of this week. And again, following on beautifully from that in the guidance part of the reading, you have the card, the two of teacups. And this is about getting together with somebody else as well. This is the card of conversation and discussion. The angels on the card here are talking to each other. They're having a conversation. Each of them is talking, each of them will also listen. And the key message with this card is getting a very clear understanding of the other person. Communication, clear communication is key with this card. How can we help ourselves? We have the Queen of Wands. Again, the Queen cards in the deck are of an authority figure again. The Queen of Wands brings with her the qualities of confidence. Look, it says here, yes, I can. She can turn her hand to anything and make it a success because she's learned how to do that. And here, look, with a slight movement of the wand, she's manifested a teapot, a teacup of tea and a cake. It's that easy for her. She knows exactly what she's doing. So here we have an energy of someone who has learned and is happy to share this information with you. She can manifest just what she needs and she's happy to do that. She's happy to show somebody else how to do the same. Pulling it all together, we've got card number 12, Awakening. This is the card that reminds you to be absolutely lovely individual you. To have some fun, to have a break. It also reminds you to look at things from a new perspective. And look at the angel here, she's completely upside down. She's looking at the world completely differently. So this is something that could well come in after your discussions with other people, new positive perspectives, new ways forward. 
And then the outcome card, one of the best cards in the deck. You've got number 17, the star. Wishing on a star. And here our lovely angels are sitting together. And there is the shooting star across the heavens. They can make their wishes, make their dreams, start getting those manifested because they're going to know exactly how to do it here. So time to make those dreams come true. Time to start working towards those goals that you've always wanted to do. So just to summarize, advice, information, motivation is key for you this week. Working alongside other people in a team and in a group will work well. And clear conversations and clear communication are important. Get ready to manifest just exactly what you need. Take on the qualities of this queen of confidence, of manifestation, and knowing that you can do it. Celebrate being lovely individual you, take on new positive perspectives, and then time for dreams coming true, working towards those new goals, and absolute success on its way for you. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button, make the bell ring, then you'll get notified when I do the next one for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.